Let's look at a typical vertebrae and identify some of the parts of it. We have the body or centrum of the vertebrae, a spinal canal where the spinal cord will travel up and down. There is a transverse process on each side and a spinous process at the very back posteriorly. There are two parts of this um, circle or arch in the spinal canal. We have an anterior arch on each side between the body and transverse process. And these are called pedicles. Then between the transverse process and the spinous process is another arch on either side and this is called the lamina. So we have lamina and pedicles and an easy way to remember which one is which lamina is last. In other words, it's the most posterior structure. Now I'm going to turn this on its side a little bit and we're going to look at it from the side because we can actually see the superior articulating pillar and the inferior articulating pillar and this superior pillar has a facet or superior articulating um, process on it and that superior articulating surface is going to mesh with the bone up above it. And then those two bones together are going to create a space here called the intervertebral foramen or the foramen between the two vertebrae. This is where your spinal nerves are going to exit from your spinal cord. There will be a disc in between each one of these uh, two vertebrae creating a joint.